material. My leech moss looks like this. Can you see it? Yes, I can see it. This is, is this sphagnum moss? Can you tell us? I don't think this is sphagnum moss, but um, the leech um, they will use any kinds of moss. Oh, well, that's very helpful to know as well. Okay, so you can use any kind of moss. It's not important which moss you use. But Frederick was saying, don't use the regular kind of moss that grows on the on the rocks on the like the the moss that's on the stones and things. He said, don't use that. I don't think why I don't why we don't should you. Oh, that. okay then. Good. All right. So you disagree with that opinion? Okay, that's good to know. That's helpful. Yeah. Well, um, Cyril, <laughs> I'm so happy with the, with with you w interviewing with me. So I'm just I can't even contain my excitement because I I learned so much from you. Can you join us again for another interview in the future? Uh, maybe um, when I have time. That's a maybe. Oh, that's good. That's hopeful then. Um, Cyril, I would like to discuss for next time the leech behavior and things that leeches do that tell you what's happening with them. So if it's all right with you, I would like to have you again on the show. And let's everyone, let's hope that he comes back. Also, I'm going to link Cyril's um, information below and if he has a channel or if he has any information on uh, how he can be contacted as well as the leech forums where he hangs out at and where he answers questions, I'm uh, linking them below. Also, uh, be sure to thumbs up this video and be sure to subscribe to follow me on YouTube as well as I uh, encourage you to visit Cyril's channel and subscribe on his channel as well. And uh, thank you again for coming and visiting and we hope it was educational for you and we'll see you next week. Bye!